Alright everyone, welcome back to the Baldur's Gate Let's Play of Shield Brothers. I don't know why I called it that. It's such a silly name. But, you know, I'm going to keep it like that. There's no point in changing it now. Alright, so last time we explored this area and we made a big mistake when we missed that stupid cave right there. And so now we're going to explore this map and once we're done here, we're going to go down there. I hope. Oh, crap. What's hitting me? Who hit? Oh, goblin or er, hobgoblins. Okay. Everyone come up here. You kill him, you kill him, you kill him. You guys start shooting them from up from down there. Actually, we need to refill your arrows. You guys are really low on arrows. And yes, that is my desire, you weird woman. My blade will cut you down to size. Okay, these guys are already going up there to attack. Come on. Are you just gonna stand there or are you gonna kill them? Wow, that was a good hit, Carmen. You made him explode. I didn't know you had it in you. There seem to be a lot of hobgoblins in this area. I'm gonna take some of their arrows to give to these two gals. Okay. What would you have me do? Would have you come over here to explore? We're on an adventure, and the adventure starts now. No, don't attack him. One. Just a nothing. Actually, I'm not sure if she's done nothing. How much has she actually done? Let's look. Information. She's got 59 kills. So, that is actually pretty lengthy of things she's done. Or something like that. Kill the wolf. Wow, that guy. This wolf is tough. Jeez. That took a while. <laughs> Remove all this black area. Yuck. They don't like black area. Uh, there seems to be nothing up here. I don't think there's going to be anything up there either. Okay, never mind. Whoa! Oh crap, he's... I'm so happy I always keep an antidote on Minsk because he's the only one who ever seems to get poisoned. Do we have another? No, we don't. You go that way. I need you to stinking cloud. Oh, I don't think that did what I wanted it to. I got those archers though, so that's good. We can go kill those archers with our archers. Man. Oh no, Minsk. You're poisoned again. Uh, luckily we've got slow poison. Maybe we should keep more than one though. Alright. Oh, we're just gonna take all your gold. Man, I'm starting to feel like just picking up their random gold's a waste of time, even though they've got actually a pretty decent amount. I think I've just been playing Torchlight 2 too much. Container's full, that's stupid. Maybe you should cheat for more gem bags. Nah, I'm not gonna do that. I don't need any more. I'm just gonna take up more inventory space, whatever. Oh, I think... I'm not sure what's down here. I don't remember. I know there's a tower because obviously the map icon's a tower even though the, our icon's covering it. And it looks like it's falling into nighttime. Okay. Sword Coast. Uh, I think we knew that. Is this way blocked? Yeah, it looks.
looks like it might be. Uh, but it isn't. Barely, anyway. Let's go up here. Uh, let's quick save it. It's always good to quick save every once in a while. Uh, there's a road. Or what looks like a road. Wargs. Oops, no, 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 you fight that guy. What's that smell? Who's that? Whoa. Whoa, what happened to Mince? Suddenly he's like a whole lot more injured. Let's have him help Clarem and then he can heal him up. Alright, him and Tor can heal him up. And Clarem at the same time. Oh, Safana leveled up. Good. Who's... I do not remember this person out here. Yeah, it's nice. Alright, skills. Um... <laughs> I don't think we're gonna keep her. Let's just put it into set traps. Uh... Do, 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 do. So she gained, what, 3 HP? 2. She gained 2 health. <laughs> wow. Alright, I guess some sort's gonna approach this strange looking woman. Pleasure to meet you. Who might you be then? Ah, great adventures, no doubt. I can tell by your hands, stained with the magic and effort of hefting a weapon. With or stained with magic and the effort of hefting a weapon. I don't use magic. Well, I do have healing spells, so I guess that's true. Such markings may be invisible to the average guy, but I can see them plain as day. I see a lot of a lot, a lot plain as day. Care for consultation? Perhaps a little old-fashioned palm reading? A little gypsy magic to steer your course straight and true? So she's a gypsy. Um. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm not sure Hemantor would uh, trust her about it. I'm not sure this is what he would say, though. He definitely doesn't really have access to his own magic in a matter of speaking. He's just got some strange abilities that he's picked up from his brother, no less. Um, but I don't I don't think he sees that as harmful, so you know what? I don't think I don't think he cares, so yeah. It's a glip, glimpse into his future, so I, I don't think he'd refuse. At least not like that. <laughs> Let's have a look now. Interesting. Though you lived the hard life now, your hands tell a softer existence not long ago. I assume that you've just recently taken to the road. Yeah? I thought as much. Let's have a little closer now. Back down your lifeline, I see scholar influence, and you are well educated. You had a mentor that was great. That was a great sage, perhaps considerable, of considerable power as well. How do you know that? I don't get I thought you were looking into my future, not my past. Yeah, I don't think he's done. He's not. If that's what you wish, so be it. It's more polite to old gypsy women, women in your future, though. Well, you didn't tell anything of my future. You just blabbed on about my past, so... I don't know how safe she was either. I mean, if she was just hanging around these pack of dread wolves right behind her, that's not very wise. And they're just gonna stand there watching. Any day now. Come on, kill the dread wolves. Thank you. Let's move on. All right. Let's quick save again. Because I know there are more sirens around here somewhere. We're gonna go this way. Do, 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 do. What the heck? Another random moment in the middle of nowhere. Who's got the letter A as her, in her name as well? Ardruin. 
Okay. Please help me. I don't know where else to turn. My little boy is playing in that abandoned lighthouse to the northwest when a pack of wargs surrounded it. Please turn them back and I can coax them down. There's not much time. Wow, okay. I don't remember this quest. I've never gotten that. Here's the lighthouse. Well, there's definitely some wards. I really do not remember that quest, though. I've never seen that one before. That's interesting. I swear, every single time I play this game, there's something new that I find, and I guess this is no exception. Alright. So, we took care of those. Let's go talk to her again. She's just right down here, I believe. Yeah, there she is. Thank you so much. You probably scared him as much as the war, so I'll coax him down once you've left. Here's some money. Here, this money is all my husband brought back from the market this week, but take it. My son's life is worth this and so much more. There's no option to refuse the gold. Oh, 60 gold. She gave us 60 gold. And you're like, you know what? I don't need this. Here's 400 gold. Take it and leave it. I don't need it. You'd probably need a whole lot more than I do. But at least I got re reputation. But seriously, there should have been an option to go, no, 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 no. I don't need your gold. Here, have 400 gold instead. I don't need it. You look like you need it more. And that should have given me, like, two reputation instead. Alright, um, I think that's everything. This map is explored enough. There's not much to it else. So, let's go south. And I believe there's something waiting for us here to do. Alright, this is going to take a while to explore. Let's just go straight down to where I think I've got a quest to do. Uh, can we get down this way? Yeah. We can just magically go through the trees. Uh, can we go down this way? Uh, that's really rocky. Alright, after this area... Uh, I'm not sure where I want to go. I think we should probably go exploring a little bit more around this area. And once we're done exploring these areas here, we're going to go over here. We need to get this area explored. And then we need to go... I think we might go to the Firewind Bridge. Check that area out. But all of that we'll have to wait for future episodes. I'm not sure we'll even get to Firewind until maybe 3, 4... Four, maybe even five episodes later from this one. Aww. Not sure I'm going the right direction. I just kind of found this road. Oh. Uh, I believe this is it. You'll feel the sting in my boot if you bother me further. Please, I beg of you to go no further. Brig is there, strewn about with the carnage he has wrought. I have tried to reason with him, but it is as if he is possessed by another soul. It was all I could do to flee the swing of his tremendous blade. Please, unless you wish to witness the madness in a once good man, leave him be and pray the spirit leaves him in good time. I don't know. Uh, who's Brig? Before this curse befell him, he was captain of the guard in Nashville. I'm his cousin. Oh boy. What you want? I'm so this is the old captain of the guard of Nashville. So, we heard about him a while ago. Greetings, playthings. Thou hast found me when I alone could not. I pray you left a trail of crumbs to lead us all back again. 
The others did not, so they have decided to stay. Shall we try to find the way home together? I pose you a riddle. The answer to which I once knew, but now cannot perceive. Remind me, and we shall all return unto day. Fail, and stay with me in the dark, forgetting whence we came. It is neither mouth nor teeth, yet it eats food its food steadily. It is neither village nor home, nor hands nor feet, yet it wanders everywhere. It is neither country nor means nor office, nor pen, yet it is ready for fight always. By day and by night there is wailing about it. It has no breath, yet to all it appears. Alright, well, let's see. Here's the lighthouse. Go for the ice pool. Go for the ice well, there's definitely some wards. What would you insist? Make it quick. Let's squeaky wheel. I really do not remember that quest though. Go for the ice. I've never seen that one before. That's interesting. Swear, every single time I play this game, there's something new that I find, and I guess this is no exception. Alright, so we took care of those. Let's go talk to her again. She's just right down here, I believe. Yeah, there she is. Thank you so much. You probably scared him as much as the war, so I'll coax him down once you've left. Here's some money. Yeah, this money is all my husband brought back from the market this week, but take it. My son's life is worth this and so much more. There's no option to refuse the gold. Oh, 60 gold. She gave us 60 gold. And you're like, you know what? I don't need this. Here's 400 gold. Take it and leave it. I don't need it. You'd probably need a whole lot more than I do. But at least I got re reputation. But seriously, there should have been an option to go, no, 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 I don't need your gold. Here, have 400 gold instead. I don't need it. You look like you need it more. And that should have given me, like, two reputation instead. Alright, um, I think that's everything. This map is explored enough. There's not much to it else. So, let's go south. And I believe there's something waiting for us here to do. Alright, this is going to take a while to explore. Let's just go straight down to where I think I've got a quest to do. Uh, can we get down this way? Yeah. We can just magically go through the trees. Uh, can we go down this way? Uh, that's really rocky. Alright, after this area, uh, I'm not sure where I want to go. I think we should probably go exploring a little bit more around this area. And once we're done exploring these areas here, we're going to go over here. We need to get this area explored. And then we need to go, I think we might go to the Firewind Bridge. Check that area out. But... All of that we'll have to wait for future episodes. I'm not sure we'll even get to Fireline until maybe three, four, maybe even five episodes later from this one. Aww. Not sure I'm going the right direction. I just kind of found this road. Oh. Uh, I believe this is it. Please, I beg of you to go no further. Brig is there, strewn about with the carnage he has wrought. I have tried to reason with him, but it is as if he is possessed by another soul. It was all I could do to flee the swing of his tremendous blade. Please, unless you wish to witness the madness in a once good man, leave him be and pray the spirit leaves him in good time. I don't know. Uh, who's Brig? Before this curse befell him, he was captain of the guard in Nashville. I'm his cousin.
Oh boy. What you want? So this is the old captain of the guard of Nashville. So we heard about him a while ago. Greetings, playthings. Thou hast found me when I alone could not. I pray you left a trail of crumbs to lead us all back again. The others did not, so they have decided to stay. Shall we try to find the way home together? I pose you a riddle, the answer to which I once knew, but now cannot perceive. Remind me, and we shall all return unto day. Fail, and stay with me in the dark, forgetting whence we came. It is neither mouth nor teeth, yet it eats food its food steadily. It is neither village nor home, nor hands nor feet, yet it wanders everywhere. It is neither country nor means nor office, nor pen, yet it is ready for fight always. By day and by night there is wailing about it. It has no breath, yet to all it appears. Alright, well, let's see. War? Let's see. War fits except for... And yet it wanders everywhere. War doesn't wander everywhere. It can, but it doesn't. So, in country, normally wars are fought between countries. Mm. Wind? No. No one cares about wind. The insect? I have no idea what that is. Death? Death is the easiest one here, so that's him sort of going to go for. He's talking to Minz, so I think Minz would probably answer stupidly, but no, it's the Simidor's decision. The end of night, where the light shines into my eyes, and I can see clearly once again. What have I wrought? Tis horrible. Horrible! I will, re I will welcome the black that must await me in Nashkel, or at Nashkel. How could I live with what I've done? Please, I must guide me to the town that I might pr pay for my crimes. I fear I can keep my senses for only so long, and I must not be allowed to do so again. Too many good people have lost their lives to me. Please. Um. Yeah. I don't think Himtor cares too much about a bounty, even though he has uh, done a lot of crime here. He's I don't think Himator thinks, or at least Clerman thinks that uh, he's not responsible for um, paying or killing him for his crimes. So he's got no jurisdiction over his crimes. So yeah, we're going to take him back and let Nashkel deal with him. Cause we don't really have a right to do that to him. We could, but I don't think Clarman would uh, be happy about that. So here we are back at Nashville. Play things. Thou hast found me when I alone could not. No, I cannot show my face here after what I've done. Give me to the guard that I might t take my punishment as I should. Do not disgrace me further in front of Helm. Calm yourself, Prag. Helm sees all that he wishes and knows much of what y you do not. It was your hands indeed that made. Uh, did many f a foul and uh, many a foul deed, but it was not your will alone. Intent is vital, and yours was influenced without your knowledge. Justice will be done, but with atonement, not punishment. But my crimes, my family, I don't want to go on. If you are returned to the garrison, yours will be the only willful kill killing that has occurred about this matter. It will be a waste of your life, which fractured though it though it is, can still contribute much. And we'll see you through. As though for our intre intrepid friends here, I shall exceed the reward offered by Ublek. After all, it was some ta it was the same task of bringing break to justice. The temple is in your debt for the return of its lost son. Okay, one thousand gold. That bad. And it's actually a really quick trip back here. And of course, now we're gonna have to travel all the way back to that place to re-explore it. Thanks for that. Yes, yes. Did we get, um, no, we didn't get any more reputation. What's our reputation at? 17. Not bad. 
There's Zan. I'm surprised he's not dead yet. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Do, 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 do. Wow, we traveled here instantly. It didn't take any time to get here. And it's still raining. Or did it just start raining? I wasn't paying attention, but still. Business has been poor, but with the iron shortage and all. Yes, and I'm about to make you go out of business because I've got so much crap and you're just gonna buy it all because, you know, you do that. Whoops. Go back to my gem bag. Got so many freaking stupid gems. Okay. Does he got? Yes, he does. No, he's not, he doesn't have any in there. <laughs> Alright, I guess we're going to sell plate mail and stuff. That, what's this bucket used to have? Two-headed sword cursed berserkering. This cursed sword, which performs perfectly under every test, save for the heat of battle. Upon entering combat, the wielder will immediately go berserk, killing everything within reach until either calming down or falling unconscious. A very powerful sword, but one must decide whether or not it is worth the risk. Even once the battle fury has ended, this sword can only be removed via an exorcism using a remove curse spell. It's a really good sword, and it's definitely better than a normal one, but I'm just going to sell it. I don't think it's worth it. Um, is there anything else we need to buy or sell? We've got plenty of arrows, I think. I don't think he's got much he can sell us. Right. Okay. Um. Hmm. I'm tempted to actually take Zen back because we don't need Safana anymore, and she's not. Actually, I know who I want. I know exactly who's perfect for this spot in the party. He's one random little fellow we saw near um, the one place. High Hedge. Man named Kivan just standing there in the open not doing anything. And we're gonna die, aren't we? Yep. Yeah, thanks someone. You inspire everyone. Kill them. You, you point, I punch. That was a piece of cake. Scroll thingy, ring thingy, and gold. And I think sometimes if you actually stay in these areas long enough that more enemies will end up appearing. I don't get that. I'm not sure if that's what's supposed to happen or not. We haven't explored much of this area either. <laughs> all right, all right. Ten hours, I think we need to rest. So we're going to rest. Now it's daytime. Now it's probably a little bit more safe. I hope. Probably not, but I hope. And there he is. Alright, Stefano, we're going to have to get rid of you now. She's got the same color hair as M1. What the heck? Alright, we're going to take all of your arrows and stuff away. You can keep that bow. But everything else is now ours. I still need to sell those stupid bandit scalps. Maybe we should go to Bergost after that to do that. What takes you up this far from civilization? We are adventurers ready to smite any evil that darkens our path. Strange coincidence, I have a custom blood of your own. I've been hunting the bandits in this region for the past few months. Perhaps if we work together and fare better. What do you say? Well... Hmm... We'll help you. Only if you tell us why. Nah, I'm 
Well, I don't think he'd say that. Actually, yeah, tell us why. Their leader, an ogre named Tezok, took the life of someone very dear to me. Alright. Goodbye, Safana. You are no longer required. What do you want? Yes, dear. Can I not stay with you even a little longer? Our time has been quite enjoyable. Oh well, perhaps we should meet again. Yes, goodbye. So how is he? 27? Uh, let's see. He's got a lot of strength. He's got pretty good dexterity. Not so much constitution for a ranger. That's kind of weird. Intelligence? He's not that smart. Charisma? Zero. Chaotic? Good. Neutral? Good. Wow, he's actually chaotic. Good. That's interesting. So we're all still the good. Neutral? Good. Lawful? Good. Karma and Dinah here are the only lawful good. Minsk, me, and M1 are all neutral, and then he's chaotic. Okay. He's already got a bow, and then he's got a melee weapon, which is a halberd, which is kind of interesting. Longbow. Okay, then. Now we'll give him all the arrows he needs. What kind of armor does he have? He's already got that kind of armor. We should probably get him some new armor. Why did we sell that plate mail? That was good stuff. We could have had him have that. Oh well. Okay. There you go. And we'll give him some more arrows like that. And there you can have that ring. Okay. What would you have me do? Goodbye, Safana. We will not meet again, and if we do, maybe I'll kill you. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. At least Simtor wouldn't. I don't think he just randomly kills people just for the fun of it. I think at some point he might. I don't, well, maybe not. I don't know. Bear Ghosts, let's do some shopping. Yay, shopping. We've not been in this part of the map before. Wow. There's still black crap everywhere. Who are you? Okay, you've got nothing intelligent to say to me then. Um, to the jovial juggler. Right, bandit scalps. Okay. All oh, right. I forgot that he's got some of these arrows. He's also got one of these. Let's give that to Minsk because he's... Oh, he actually does have potions. What is he doing with all these stupid potions? Hurry up. Wait, before we actually do go there... Hey, where'd our... Let's get over here, you dummy. Let's go and earn some of our... Um, our silly valuable potions that we don't need. You want some whiskey? Yes, yes I do! Alright. Potion of absorption. Goodbye. Infravision. Goodbye. Strength. Goodbye. Bandit scalps. They actually buy those here. Why would they ever do that? Potion of mirrored eyes. We're keeping that. Alright. I think that's everything. Oh no it's not. That's nice. I don't want cheap beer. Blindness. We're selling bi blindness. <laughs> So many stupid spell jokes. We're selling bandit scalps today. Would you like some? Of course, I'll take 25 gold apiece. Did he take 25 gold apiece? Let's see. Uh, 8 would go for 200. Is that 25 gold apiece? Let's see. Yes, it is. But these guys sell for double the amount, so we're going to take it to them. So these 8 should give us 400. I can't believe my math might actually hold up. Can I assist you? Yep, 400. Wow. I did not know that I was going to be that good at math here. That's amazing. I'm not usually that great at math. I suck at math. I think I've said that before, but I don't know I don't remember. My memory is really bad too. Very bad. This 
This stuff a legend. Yes. Boo is always correct. I can make whatever you wish. Yes, yes, we know it's not ready. Okay, we want your cup sight bow. We want your um we can buy more arrows. A plate mail. Ooh, we're really close to being able to buy that, but we can't yet. That really stuck. Stinks. I was about to say stacks. That doesn't make any sense. That really stacks. Yeah, we'll buy four. Thank you. Throw that in the trash. Stupid. You can use those for now. Okay. I think we're good now. Oh, no, we're not. We need a uh, helmet for you. There, you can have a silly harmed helmet. And even though it says horns, it's not horned here. Because this is Tutu, and that doesn't make any sense. Oh, it does make sense, because it's Tutu. And Tutu doesn't use those horned helmets. I don't know why they wouldn't, though, because they look absolutely cool. But no, these, those kind of helmets look stupid. I like the horns one better. And I'm not sure how long we've been going for this, but I'm sure it's already been half an hour, so I think this will be the end of this episode. Next time, we'll be going to the area of that and exploring it all. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If it was too short, well, then the next episode should be out soon. Maybe. I hope. And uh, we'll see you next time.